here's the truth. I have never broken a bone, knock on wood, but I fractured a bone and it was my finger and I was playing catch. Super cool, right? I was playing catch with an orange, yes, the fruit at a beach on the 4th of July. That was probably 16. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> I have never broken a bone either, also knock on wood. Though, uh, as I was growing up, I had a knack for kicking things and hurting my pinky toe, all on accident. I didn't have anger issues or anything like that. But I heard it many times. And my mom would always give me this advice and tell me, well, if you think it's broken, you can tie a ribbon around it because there's nothing a doctor can do to help fix your pinky toe. So there you have it. Customer service advice I've ever received is probably the simplest advice ever. And it actually came from you, Jeremy. That advice is customer service is just people helping people. At the end of the day, it's just one person helping another person do what they need to do. And honestly, that advice, as simple as it sounds, has gotten me through a lot of really sticky situations. That simple reminder really makes all the difference. So thanks. The best customer service advice I've ever received, and I don't even remember where it came from, um, but is to not take things personally. I actually heard about this in a book recently, a cool acronym, Q-Tip, quit taking it personally. Uh, but I, I can be a real hothead. I can remember once throwing my telephone uh, as a as a contact center agent and I realized that didn't get me anywhere you know it made calls longer um, it made the experience less pleasant it um, made the next call that much more difficult because I was all worked up from the last one uh, but gradually as I've uh, grown more wise <laughs> I guess I'm getting older as well uh, I've learned that um, not to take things personally um, to step back, realize that the customer isn't attacking me. The customer's not angry at me, typically. You know, I've made a few angry in my day, but but they're not angry at me, and really they're just seeking a solution. And when I look at it from that standpoint, I can work to calm the customer down and work to arrive at a solution with them. And uh, it's turned a lot of situations around that advice, so I'm thankful for that. <laughs>